Hey loves, it's Christy Love. Today's video is a battle of the bombs, baby. Lip balm it is, okay? So, winter's trying to get out of here, spring is trying to get in here, and everybody needs a kissable pout, no matter what time of the year it is, okay? So in order to get a kissable pout, you must, you must, you must use lip balm underneath your lip gloss, your lipstick, whatever lippy you're using. You need some lip balm, so I'm just here to tell you, you need lip balm. So I absolutely love lip balms. I am a lip balm fanatic. I may have anywhere from seven to eight in rotation at a time with backups uh, hidden just in case because I don't want to be without my lip balm. Um, I may have two or three on my desk. I may have three or four in my purse. I may have two or three on my vanity. I'm just saying I need my lip balm, okay? So I'm just going to review a couple of my favorites today and then at the end of the video there may or may not be a giveaway. So I hope you keep watching. Thanks. Uh, let's start with one of my favorites. Eos. Everybody loves this little guy here. It's so cute. It looks like a little egg. Everybody loves it. And I can tell you this. I use this like every morning after I moisturize my face. Um, I want to go ahead and moisturize my lips. I may also use this like in the evening when I wash my face. Just because I don't like that dry lip feeling. So this little guy is like my favorite. Um, yeah, it's my favorite, okay? And you know what I like about this is that it says long lasting and it actually is. I don't find myself reapplying when I use this. And that's always good. So, kudos to this little guy. And the next one is soft lips. So, one of my coworkers um, gave me this for like Christmas, left it on my desk because they know I like lip gloss too. So, this little guy, I think, hmm, let's see. It has SPF of 20. And this is supposed to protect the lips. Now, this scent is in vanilla, which is fine with me. I like vanilla. Um, I can deal with that. The only problem I have with this little guy, and I can't even get it open. Oh, mm, using the wrong hand, lady. So, the, the little uh, applier is so skinny. And I find myself, like, going around and around and around and around and around. So I don't like that. I want to, you know, do two or three swipes and let's be out. You know what I mean? So, you know, yeah, I'm not a fan of this little guy, but it does stay on my desk and I use it. I don't throw anything away. Um, the next one I like is Burt's Bees. And it's an all-natural product. And I forgot to mention EOS is all-natural as well. But Burt's Bees is all-natural. And this one I got is a tinted lip balm. I like this one on my desk as well because um, sometimes I just want that moisture effect and I don't want like lip gloss or lip color, but I don't want plain lips either. So I got it in tinted and I really like this little guy and it's okay. I'm not in love with Burst Bees, so I'll be. Um, my other favorite is Baby Lips. So, you know, everybody knows Baby Lips comes in a variety of colors. There's tints, there's shears. Um, these little guys are great. I like to roll with these in my purse because, again, if I just want a little bit of color and some moisture, then this works well for me. Um, the only thing I know about this is that I do have to reapply. So this hydrates, however, I have to reapply. So, you know, I like your Baby Lips, but it's not like my favorite is not the best but it works so i like this little guy and all of the ones i'm reviewing today are in the same price range like in the three dollar range um yeah so i wanted to mention that now this also is my favorite little guy too this is the vaseline jar and it's a mini so you know i like that and this one is rosy lips so they have this in like cocoa butter they have it in plain but i like it because it's a little guy this, what I mostly use this for, is by my bedside. I use it at nighttime before I go to sleep. You know, of course, petroleum, it's hydrating. It's going to sink in overnight. So I really love that. And when I wake up, I don't feel dry lips. That's my pet peeve. I don't like dry lips. I don't want you to have dry lips. Yeah, dry lips, no. Okay? So those are my five 
favorites. Again, they're all in the same price range. Um, but one thing I want to note too that I've tried and I love, and I think it's important when you're talking lips and lip care, is a lip ex exfoliator. Now, this is the one I'm currently using and I love it. And it's by e.l.f. So, you know, e.l.f. is... I can't remember if I paid a dollar for this, but I think it's $3. That's what I think it is. I think it's $3. Now, this, it looks like this, and it has, like, some kind of particles in it or something. Whatever you exfoliate with, it has a scrub in it, and I love that. I like that it's in a tube. Most of my lip scrubs are in pots, and you have to dip your finger in it, and I'm not really a fan of dipping my finger in anything to put it on my lips. I'm just not. However, I make exceptions to this guy because I'm using it to go to bed at night. But this I like because it's in a tube. It applies well. The smell is great. Um, and it doesn't require that I kind of wash it off. Now, you do wipe it off after you use it, but I don't have to wash it off like with a lot of my other scrubs because uh, whatever is in them is very sandy and very gritty. Um, so I'm, I've been loving this little guy and uh, yeah, you should try it. Elf Lip Exfoliator. So now we've come to the end of our review and I didn't go into details you know I didn't look these products up and see what their claim to fame is and you know what other people like about them I'm just telling you what I like about them so the giveaway now the giveaway is going to run for one week from the date this video was uploaded um, I'm not really sure when that's going to be but it's going to be one week so I'll put the information in the drop box below. It's not going to be, it's not going to require that you do a whole lot to enter because listen, I enter giveaways all the time and I don't want to do a whole lot to enter. I'm sorry. You know, you can't have my firstborn. You can't have my DNA. You can't have my social. I'm not going to follow you on 27 different networks. I'm just not going to do it. Sorry. And I mean, those are your stipulations. Those are your stipulations. Hey, do you boo? Okay. But mine is going to be simple. It's my first giveaway. Um, it's not an expensive giveaway, so I'm not going to make you, you know, jump through hoops to get it. But what, you, let me see. So I want you to be a subscriber, number one. Uh, number two, you have to leave a comment below that says, telling me what your favorite lip balm is. And it could be any brand, any price, but I want to try some others because again, I love lip balm. So yeah, be a subscriber. Number two, leave a comment below of what your favorite lip balm is. That is how you enter. That is how you win. There is only one winner. This is a U.S. resident contest only. That's important. And um, it's going to run for one week. So the information is going to be in the drop box. Now, let me show you what you're going to win. So, of course, you're going to win my favorite, EOS. This is in Sweet Mint. So, I hope you like that. And you're going to win the Baby Lips. The mm, Cherry Me. That's a cutie patootie. You're going to get the Vaseline Little Rosie. Mm -hmm, my three favorites. And as a bonus, because I suggested it, you're also going to get the e.l.f. Lip Exfoliator. So you're going to get four products. They're all around $3. That is a $12 value. Maybe a little bit more. Plus the shipping handling is going to be on me. Um, I'm not sure how I'm going to announce the winner. I may do another video. Um, and I may just put it below. We'll just see. Okay. So anyway, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for listening. Thank you so much for caring. Um, have a great day, loves. Bye.